Let me tell you something. This takes me back. I think I remember first seeing this game over at... Uh, we're going to delete this save game. I remember seeing this game over at a friend's house years and years ago when I was a kid. And ever since I tried playing it a couple times, I've always wanted a copy for myself. So I eventually managed to get one. And I enjoyed it. I put a lot of hours into this game. And this was probably one of the best games uh, in the Kirby franchise at the time. At least all the way up until when they came up with Kirby Superstar from Super Nintendo. But that's when... Oh, man, that one probably became my favorite Kirby game of all time. Okay. So just to double check, we're not supposed to use any captured enemy attacks, so I cannot... I cannot uh, copy any abilities. I have to play it normally. Which, again... I can do that. I can do that. I just gotta be careful not to accidentally absorb any abilities, like from, say, from a museum, or, or accidentally hit the down button. So. And I have to do this all the way up until Grape Garden, which is the fourth area. Or they call it the fourth level. So we'll be at it for a while. Yes! Should I bother with the bonus games? Ah, hell, why not? Crane Fever! I'll at least do one of each of these uh, mini games. Let's get the little one then. At least I get one one up. Here comes the first mini boss. Oh, Poppin' Brother Jr. How's it going, buddy? Here's a bomb back in your face. I'm just slide in the home base on your face. so good. Didn't, do, didn't time that jump right that time. Alright, 
give me one second. Let me hop in the Discord here. Hey, Bill, if you're interested uh, in the chat, uh, you can hop in the uh, hop in the, the voice stream chat on Discord if you want to talk. Hey, Razor. How's it going? Doing good, Bill. How's, how's it going for you, man? Can't complain. I'm just, uh, well, obviously, I can't do Pac-Man, so there's, there's really nothing for me to do, so I'm just watching what you're doing. That's cool. That's cool. I must say, I, I'm, I've seen pretty much about uh, all your videos so far um, for some of the other, like, some of the racing games and puzzle games, especially Marvel Madness. I... Seriously, you must have had a lot of practice in pulling some of those challenges off. Well, you know, a lot of those challenges, like you said, it just comes down to practice. I mean, like Marble Madness is ridiculous. I had to watch the world record runner. Uh, his name was Yells Rake to get that one done. There is no way I could have done some of those without just watching YouTube videos. Hmm. Understandable. So, as far as Final Fantasy goes, I, I'll eventually get to that. I know that's probably going to take the most time-consuming, since you practically have to beat the game without dying once. But, let me tell you this. There's a good friend of mine, uh, Jeremy. Known him since middle school. Best buds, you know, game buds for life. Um, also a big fan of, 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 of that game, of Final Fantasy VI. And... <laughs> He wants me to take this particular challenge to the next level. So check this out. Not only does he want me to go through without dying, but he wants me to make it a bit of a, nuz uh, uh, a, a nuzlocke of sorts, if you know what I mean. Well, what's he got planned? If a character falls, he or she stays dead. Well, you know, there's going to be points in the game where it's almost guaranteed you're going to lose a character here, unless you got, like, life three on them or something. <laughs> yeah. I know. He thinks it can be done, but I'm not so sure you can do go with the permadeath on characters. Yeah, I, I've... Ooh, I'd have to really think about that. that. That That would be very, very tricky. Now, of course, there's a couple of spots in the game. Story base, you have to, you have to like be defeated. I mean, that's a given. He said, "No, no, that wouldn't count." Obviously, I said, "I should hope not." <laughs> that would be uber pro for sure. I'd be interested to see if you could pull that off. I might have to, in all honesty, do a a challenge. Uh, uh, a, a, a practice run, like a serious practice on that to see if I can pull it off. I I want to say I could, but again, if if life three doesn't doesn't um, count, then yeah, just technically you wouldn't be defeated. I mean, you'd come right back to life and you could still win it, like against that Magi Master character in that one tower, but like. Eh, we'll have to see. That's all I can say. Oh! Oh, that's okay. That's cool. Hey, I'm I'm glad you got to come on, if at least for a few minutes, so I can chat with you in person. I mean, if you gotta if you gotta bounce, I I, I get it. It's cool. 
I appreciate you as always uh, coming to hang out. If I got any other questions on challenges, I'll be sure to reach out to you. thing would let me suck him in when he was in tor tornado form. Ah, damn. I timed that. I did not time that jump well at all. Shit. Let's see. What game was this again? Oh, Egg Catcher! Try to eat eggs, but not bombs. Oh yeah, I remember this now. Haha! -ha. I didn't get all the eggs, but... Got one one up. Not too bad. Yeah, this is... I think this normal attack run is going to be a pretty much a cakewalk. As long as I don't accidentally touch an ability or accidentally uh, swallow any enemies, I'm pretty much set. Just got to play it the old-fashioned way. Do another crane game. Alright, once again, let's try for the two up. That should be just the right angle to get him. Perfect! Not wiggling or nothing. Alright, I'm just gonna get the little one. At least this way I'll be about guaranteed a three up. Also a perfect catch. Look at that. That's tight. Hey, game, are you there? to do that yet until later. Oh yeah, he does. Why would he do it before? Hmm. 
Sir Meta Knight. So close. Okay, I'm pretty sure I know what that is. I think that's the museum. I'm not doing the museum. Ooh. I was gonna get hit there. Wait a minute, is there a switch? Oh, no, it's a one-up. That's okay. One-ups are good. Ow. Not gonna worry about that one up. Uh, yeah, no, I'm not gonna worry about that. Ow! So close. There's the arena. I guess if I really want to get a tomato, I could do that. Nah, let's go to five. Normally this is where I would, it would be a good idea to get high jump ability, but again, I can't. I cannot do high jump, as it goes against the rules of the challenge. Oh boy. 
Oh no. Ow. Thank you for the tomato. Come on, give me one, give me one, give me one. Ah! Time for the second boss. Ouch. Ouch. All right, level three, butter building. We just gotta get through this one as normal Kirby and we will be done with the intermediate challenge for this game. So far, no ability whatsoever, just normal attacks. Here's one of the switches. Luckily, I know exactly how to do it. Perfect jump. If I were doing the other challenge where I have to be uh go with a few lives lost as possible, I'd say I'd be doing it off to a pretty good start. Oh boy. Oh. Bugsy. Oh 
Bugsy. Alrighty, we are on our way. Switch here too? I can't remember. Maybe I'm wrong. Oh, no, there wasn't. I thought there was. Damn! Back to back to back! Hell yeah! Alright, number four. Warp star time! Oh, you again. Didn't get hit once that time. Let's do a round of that. My bad.
Oh, no, you don't. If it was an extra... Yeah. Yeah, I would have... I would have probably been struggling quite a bit already. Which reminds me, I still need to... I've been, I've been kind of trying to practice up doing... Uh, 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 the extra mode in Kirby's Dreamland for the Game Boy, and... Eh... Yeah, that one, they don't want me losing a single life on that one. I don't know if I could pull that off, in all honesty. That is just, that move, that, that difficulty is just beyond brutal. Here's one of the main reasons I didn't want, not want to dare do the novice challenge to try to be pacifist for this run. This level alone, right here. My god. Just that alone, and I'm like, hell no, I am not doing that. Alright, let's try this egg catcher thing again. Oh well. And that's three eggs. I still got a one up. Alright, here comes the third boss. Once I'm done with this, I'm uh, using my normal attacks. I'll be right there at Grape Garden, and that'll be intermediate done. I completely botched that one. First death of the game. Grape Garden. And that's it. At least for now. 